but can you talk me through how you actually use Salesforce Field Service and smart, smart scheduling and how it has impacted uh, your business and your, uh, the customer service you provide? Yeah, absolutely. Look, I think we had a really unique problem. Um, we, we could traditionally sell more work than we could deliver. Um, and it was quite clunky through from sales through to field service. So, you know, traditionally our internal sales team had always been amazing at selling, you know, over the phone. Um, but when it came to scheduling the work, they're generally not the best schedulers. So we would find that our, our sales team would get stuck on the phone. We'd have clients waiting. Um, there was long wait times as they scoured through the schedule trying to find spots. Um, obviously not anymore. Uh, leveraging that AI-powered scheduling tool for us with a single click, we're presented now with different scheduling time slots. We can, we can instantly book appointments to suit the customer's needs. And I think that's the biggest one is it was reducing their frustrations um, it was listening to them and knowing that they didn't want to sit on the uh, on the phone for five or six minutes while they are, uh, our schedulers tried to find a spot. Um, and look, it, although it's been a huge change for us, there was some things that changed overnight. Uh, and I think that's that's a couple that did. Um, we we're able to improve the service level for our customers. Uh, we we're able to reduce emergency response times. We also work in the construction sector. So from that, that, that emergency response time is huge. Um, correctly scheduling the technician uh, to every job. And, and that's, that sounds easier than it is. And I, and I like that Amaruk um, pointed out earlier that when we're a smaller company, we're able to do it really easily. You know, we were able to have five or six technicians out on the road and know what their skill was and know when they needed to get there. But as we scaled, it was just impossible. So we had a reduction in travel time on top of that. Um, I think everyone knows that uh, in today's climate, the, uh, the least amount of travel time that we can have, the better. And uh, ultimately, that gave us the ability to scale our operations and start to work across um, other time zones as well.